the windshield, it's 10 below. Flight attendants, prepare for landing. Warm up your car with your smartphone. Bundle up and thank you for flying with us. Technology now possible and starting to take off. You're starting to see more products connect to the internet. And I think over time, it's, it's starting to create the sort of home of the future, right? Where everything talks to each other and things right. happen automatically. It's like the Jetsons vision. So what does this home of the future look like? I've got a button here on my phone that I can press. And when I press it, right away, it's off. Spark is a company building a product that connects items in your home with your smartphone. Our first product is the Spark Socket. Um, and it's a little device that screws into your light bulb socket, light bulb screws into the other end, it connects to the internet over Wi-Fi, and lets you control your lights from smartphone, tablet, computer, wherever. The idea started as a technology built for the founder's father, who's deaf. If, if I text him and he's at home, he doesn't know if his phone's not in his pocket. And so I wanted to build something that would let his lights flash when, uh, when he got a text message. Spark is one of several companies looking to make your home more connected. A company called SmartThings lets users attach wireless sensors around the house that make everything from your window to your refrigerator smartphone controlled. What they're trying to do is build a, a hub in the middle of your home that allows hardware, such as your scale, your stove, your door, your dog, to talk to it, and then software that allows you to be aware of what's going on. And so it'll send notifications, hey, your dog just went outside. Hey, you left your door open. The lights are on. Why now? Is it just the technology smart enough now? The platforms have been built, and so there's connectivity both in your pocket through Wi-Fi, through 3G, through LTE, but there's also connectivity at home. And major industry players are taking note. GE took the concept outside the home, experimenting with sensors, placing them on everything from wind turbines to measure efficiency to hospital patients to keep track of them in the building. You have this controller in your pocket that can enable you to do things that three, five, ten years ago were wildly impossible. Lori Siegel, CNN Money, New York.